Congratulations on taking a first step to reduce your hip pain. Our team has the expertise and technology to create a solution that's just right for you. Let's get started. In this brief online seminar, we'll cover the common causes of hip pain, treatment options, when it's time to consider joint replacement, common questions about hip replacement, what to expect for recovery, and next steps. Your joints don't go bad overnight. The pain can be constant, come and go, come on strong when you're in motion, or after sitting still for a while. Pain can happen in many locations in your body that get a lot of use. One of the causes of joint pain is arthritis, or osteoarthritis, which is a common condition. When cartilage wears down in the joints, the bones rub against each other, and it hurts. Other causes of hip pain include back pain, bursitis, tendon tears, labral tears, and femoral acetabular impingement. You can see the difference here between a healthy hip on the left and a diseased hip on the right. Notice that the cartilage looks less stable in the diseased hip, which causes pain. Your x-ray might look like this. When you talk with a doctor about hip pain, your first discussion may be about lifestyle and weight management. For every pound that you lose, you can take six pounds of pressure off of your hips. Altering your diet and making low impact exercises part of your daily routine can be a starting point. Using a walking aid can take pressure off a hurting hip, or your doctor may suggest heat or cold therapy to provide some temporary relief. He or she may also suggest anti-inflammatory medication or an oral steroid for relief of pain. Physical therapy can also be a helpful option. Your therapist will work with you to recommend exercises that strengthen the muscles around your hip. Cortisone may offer quick, effective relief, but can only be used a few times a year. After you've tried conservative treatment options, asking yourself a few questions can help you know whether it's time to explore joint replacement. Things to consider include, are you less active because of hip pain? Does hip pain keep you from doing the things you want to do? Is hip pain affecting your ability to walk upstairs? Is hip pain affecting your ability to get a good night's sleep? If you can answer yes to one or more of those questions, arthroscopy or joint replacement may be able to help you. Based on the condition of your hip and answers to questions about your lifestyle and goals, your doctor will recommend a variety of treatment options such as total hip replacement. More than 450,000 hip replacements are performed in the U.S. every year. A hip replacement removes the arthritic bone and damaged cartilage and replaces it with a hip implant. A hip replacement is designed to smoothly move like your natural hip and has four parts that work together, a socket cup, a liner to make it smooth, a head for rotation, and a stem to connect into the leg bone. A few questions you may have include, will the joint set off a metal detector? Yes, you will set off airport metal detectors. You'll need to notify airport security and possibly go through separate screening. TSA is familiar with these situations because joint replacements are so common. Is the implant heavy? On average, implants weigh less than a pound. Can I have an allergic reaction to the implant? Because joint replacements implants contain metal, talk with your doctor if you have a sensitivity or allergy to certain metals. After surgery, our doctors, nurses, and physical therapists will set goals with you to get you back on the move. Individual results will vary, and not all patients have the same post-operative recovery. Talk with your doctor about the potential risks and benefits. Joint replacements will not allow you to do more than you could do before you had joint problems. Talk with our team about the most appropriate level of activity. Hip procedures may be an option for people who have tried conservative measures to reduce pain, but still have a reduced quality of life due to hip pain. Talking with a doctor can help you understand your options. Schedule an appointment and take a step forward for a future that could include less pain.